What a cozy day it is, huh, boys? We got a coin-making method for you guys today. Uh, yeah, no, I mean, dude, it's been a couple of days since I've dropped one, so we gotta go ahead and drop one. Uh, drinking a Canada Dry right here. Hopefully this brings us some good pack luck. And, uh, yeah, let's get this coin methods on the road. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, guys. On the road to 30k, so every single subscription helps out a ton, okay? Thank you very, very much for all those people that support me out there. Also, link down in the description to the Twitch. I stream pretty much every single night, unless there's a Boise State basketball game, or on Friday's case, aka the day you're probably seeing this, uh, if there's a Boise State State game. All right, Boise State Conference Championship football. Yes, sir. Big time dubs. Anyways, let's go ahead and take a quick look at a couple of sets, a couple of cards that could potentially be profits, uh, depending on what time of day it is. All right, most are not profit. Most sets are not profit, by the way. So keep that in mind. However, dude, like, look at this, dude. Like, Team Diamond 92s, believe it or not, are actually some of the cheapest cards on the market right now, which is funny because, you know, you could literally be buying these for training if you snipe them for cheap enough. But anyways, we're not going to talk about that right now. They dropped in price big time when pack odds boosted. And uh, yeah, so anyways, let's take a look at most, uh, not most feared, Zero Chill. All right, so Zero Chill came out yesterday or for you guys, for me today, right? Anyways, these cards are going to be going for roughly 700000 for the ones that we're going to be building for profit, okay? We're talking... Kyle Hamilton, we're talking CD Lamb. Going for about 730 to 750k, round it to about 740k for these two expensive cards. To build these, you need 390 overall zero chills, okay? Which as you can see, 180 is what they're going to be going for. You need to guy buy these for about 140 to 150k. You need 3 of them. All right, which means that you're going to be spending roughly 400 to 450,000 coins on these three cards and then the other two spots of this set you need five total 90s you're gonna need two of any other 90s and these 90s you're gonna have to pick up for pretty cheap if you want to profit like we're talking like 80 to 90k all right if you can get it for 90k you're making some profit if you if you get them for about 90 you know, or sorry 80 to 90 90k you're making a little bit less profit but some profit so with that being said a cd lamb after tax will sell for roughly 670,000 coins all right, if you buy these cards at the price I bought them for, or, you know, telling you to buy them for, you're building it for about 630,000 coins. So if he sells for the price and, he, and you get 670 after tax form, then he's profit. If not, he's not profit. And you guys need to check the market at the time you're watching this video to know if it's profit or not. All right, but this is the big time profit method I want to talk about because I love it so, so much. And that's going to be mystery packs. Guys, mystery packs are super profitable. Once again, when you buy your training for cheap, when you buy your training for super, super cheap, bro, you literally... Not, I'm not going to say you cannot lose, but the odds of losing your coins is so slim. All right, boys, I'm buying 89s for under 50,000 coins right now. The day that you're watching this, if the market is up a little bit, uh, then yeah, maybe buying for 55k and under, right, boys? But I was getting a lot of these all Maddens for about like 30 to 40k, uh, believe it or not, which is crazy cheap, okay? But 89s under 55k, all right, boys? And you're going to take those and you're going to roll them into the mystery packs. Now, I've done this on stream. I did this on stream for about four hours last night, dog, and it was super, super profitable. Made so many coins. Midfield packs, so much fun to open. Like, they are way better than they used to be, which is kind of crazy, okay? I like the midfield packs. They're solid, okay? Um, red zone packs, unbelievable. If you've watched one of my videos or any of their other people's videos, red zone packs are so much fun to open, and it's, yeah, it, it, it's crazy that these packs are in here, but we love them. 89, a beautiful pull. We love it. Now, cards you can quick sell. I'm just going to say this off rip, and then we'll talk about sets, but cards you can quick sell, guys, are going to be... 80s, 81s, 82s, and 84s, okay? Do not quick sell 83s, but you can quick sell all the other lower overall cards, all right, boys? That's just because, I mean, doing those sets, it's, yes, it'll save you a little bit of coins, but it's not necessarily worth it. It takes quite a bit of time, to be 100% honest, and, uh, well, we don't want to necessarily be sitting here and just, like, wasting a ton of time. Not really wasting time, but, like, we don't want to really be, you know, putting every last card into a set because it's just not worth it, to be honest, right? If, if it saves you 10 to 20K, it's just not worth it, in my opinion. 10 to 20K is not worth, you know, an extra 20 minutes of putting cards in the sets. All right, you can do you can do much better stuff with your time than that. All right, 85s, of course, keep 85s. 85s go into sets, and uh, yeah, those are going to be big, big makers right now, especially because the zero chill sets right now need 85s in them okay so if it's an 85 or an 86 those are going to be selling for about 13 to 16 to 15 to something k right i would recommend probably i don't know you can sell your 86s it's kind of undecided what you want to do you can put them into 88s right you can put 86s in the 88s and you're going to be losing a little bit of value or you can sell them 
or you can quick sell them really but like i don't i'd rather just sell them to be honest pro ace fantasy pack the best pack you can possibly pull right here the entire first round 81 pluses the entire second round 85 pluses if you see a coin card in the second round you better start doing the irish jig because it's going to be an insane pull 85 larry little 86 williams 85 nick benito not a very good pro ace fantasy pack right there but it is what it is they can't all be bangers right but if you haven't heard i assume you have if you haven't heard there are now 85 plus platinum cards we're talking 85 86 87 88 and 89 and 90s okay 85 sell for quick sell for about 220k and then you've got uh what's it called the 90s that quick sell for a 1.2 million coins so you can pull those in any pack other than uh exchanges so like in in your in your sets or whatever boys you can't you know pull it out of exchange sets. so keep that in mind all right guys don't be expecting it or anything like that all right that's just if you expect it you're selling yourself up for failure. I will say, we need to pull a red zone pack, okay? Red zone packs are going to be coming out of here, I mean, not as often as we like to see them, but they're actually fairly, like, consistent. Like, if you do a reroll of, like, 50,000, you know, training, you can expect to see probably five or so red zone packs. Like, on average, on average. That doesn't mean every time. That just means, like, on average over, over a spread out period of time, right, boys? 86 right there, and that's out of an 80 plus. So, one thing I have noticed about these mystery packs and you guys if you've opened it up probably noticed this as well these 70 pluses they plus quite a bit you do typically pull an 85 or like you can pull an 85 plus and it's not necessarily an insane thing right we've seen 90s come out of here yesterday i've pulled an 89 out of it like you can pull some good stuff that also carries over to like most feared packs and all madden packs right out of that other spot so most feared packs two of the spots are 70 plus spots but there's been multiple times where I always typically pull elites in those gold plus spots. So kind of crazy how that works, but it's super, super nice. Now, this is that red zone pack I was talking about, okay? And like I said, they're not necessarily the most common, but they're not like, they're not rare, right? Like you're not, you're pulling them. I'd say you're pulling four to five of them before you pull a pro ace. So that's a pretty good thing. And this is going to contain 185 plus and 283 pluses. All right. And a lot of the time you do pull a plus in here. All right. As you can see, we pulled an 86 and an 85. And then I've of course got some of my training back as well. So red zone packs are what make you a lot of coins. Okay. A lot, a lot, a lot of coins can be made off uh, red zone packs. And you know, it used to be midfield packs would lose you coins, but now reds, you know, mid midfield packs just aren't that bad anymore. They're, they're, they're pretty, you know, they're not going to be making you coins every single time, but I would say the majority of times, you know, as long as you pull an 85 plus you're making your coins back, right? Each one of these packs. Okay. With the math being done is going to cost you roughly about, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to say roughly seven, 18, 18 ish K right. 18,000 coins ish is what you're going to be paying per per pack right here so a little bit more expensive than the last pack but this is a most feared pack that i'm talking about you pull an 87 beautiful you also pull an 85 out of a 70 plus and this 70 plus is a 77 the plus is not silent that's the thing like it's not silent in these packs so you can't have a pack like that that's kind of a boom right that's like a that was like a 15k profit pack right there and it was a most feared pack right and used to just be like oh most feared you lost coins but now it's just like okay you have a chance to make coins probably not the best chance to make coins but it's still a chance to make coins all right now if you guys are still here thank you this is like the whole goal when you open these packs okay you are trying to build the 90 team builders okay the brand new 90 team builders the new ones that came out okay so it, you're gonna need 388s in 186 so that's why i'm saying keep your 85s 85s will be able to build the 88s okay and then you use those 88s and you put them into the bad boy look at there you go midfield pack with an 89 jair alexander right there that's a huge pull because that's an extra night that's like an extra 60,000 coins ish i guess after tax probably 55,000 coins which is really good because that's going to pay for about two and a half packs if not a little bit more right because we quick sold, quick sold a couple of stuff that's a very solid pack very very happy with that all right um not much to to write home about here but anyways yeah you're putting pretty much every little pack you can or every card that you can you are building up to that highly coveted 90 overall team miller those are going to be selling for roughly 170k at the time i'm filming this so this is you know still the day that most uh zero chill came out i keep saying most fear that zero chill came out right and so you see what i'm saying like it's you know if they're going 
on, on today, then they're probably going to be going the next day. There you go, another red zone pack right here. Hopefully, we can get a little streak. I, I've had some really nice streaks of these red zone packs here. We got an 86, an 83, an 83, and an 80. Not a great pack right there, but hey, to be an 86 and two 83s, these 83s go into 85 sets. So, you know, that's practically almost an 85 right there. That's almost 10K. So, that's not bad at all. If you can, if you can, if you can, you know, make about 10K per of on those on those red zone packs that's a solid man you can't really complain about that right another 86 right there we'll take it i'd call 86 is about break even because if you were to quick sell an 86 you'd get just under the amount for another pack so technically it is pretty much break even trading wise and also break even coin wise to you know value value wise so that's that's kind of what you guys got to keep in mind here when you are opening these packs man, two red zone packs though is crazy i feel like we deserve a lot more i i, I typically pull a lot more red zones than just this but i don't know goofy 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 there's a good example of pulling in at least an 80 plus out of those 70 pluses this video is a little bit longer but you know i'm trying to be 100 transparent and show you guys exactly what comes out of these packs and then also talking you guys through what cards i'm selling what cards i'm keeping what cards i'm quick selling what cards i'm putting into a set pretty much right so that way you guys have a, a really good set idea as to what i'm supposed to do what the heck i'm supposed to do with all these cards that i pull right because it's it's hard man even last night right yesterday when i was opening these mystery packs and i didn't really know what set to do so i was asking some of you guys in chat we were we were kind of you know making some making some mistakes with sets you know you gotta you gotta kind of fail before you succeed here so i was you know making some mistakes losing a little bit of coins on one set but then you know i, I find the perfect set to make the perfect card and that's where most of your coins are being made back right so that's that's kind of what you got to remember here but let's freaking go come on give us some juice here i would like a coin card i would like anything that's going to make us some really solid coins and coin cards by the way are not super rare if you can pull a high volume of red zone packs you're gonna make quite a bit of coins off coin cards if if you can pull some coin uh you know red zone packs i'd say one in every 10 to 15 red zone packs is going to have a coin card that's an 83 plus that i've noticed right that i've noticed i, I opened a, 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 a little bundle of like 50 of them this uh i guess for you guys two days ago or a day ago or whatever and uh we were able to make back a lot of our coins just off of coin quick sells you know coin quick sells and you put the other stuff in sets and boom we were profiting like big time off those red zone packs but man for some reason i don't know if they i don't know if they dimmed the odds on them but they I, they must have honestly they must have reduced the odds a little bit uh on these red zone packs which sucks but it is what it is man you know you can't really beggars can't be choosers here there's a red zone pack beautiful but yeah they're not coming out as often as they used to but still they're coming out 88 right there beautiful 85 82 86 that's a very solid pack right there to be honest boys you pull an 86 that's gonna be money back you pull this 85 that's gonna be 10k profit and then this is 40k profit so 50k profit on a red zone pack right there very very solid and that's not a, a you know that's not a hard freaking pack to pull sometimes you'll go packs of course not pulling anything my brother's calling me give me one second boys frick oh it's an eight. sorry we cut off a little early there brother that's a 40k card right there that we just pulled or at least that's what they were selling for early yeah 40k card wow beautiful let's go out of a 70 plus what did i tell you about the plus plusing it actually pluses man what an animation by the way too huh such a sexy animation boy it is amazing animation they definitely killed it with that one legend pack there we go all right now we're juicing with some uh you know rarer packs i guess you could say i would like to see oh there we go an 87 we'll take it 84 84 we'll take a little 87 though that's profit profit man these uh legend packs by the way if you pull these on the day that you're watching this and it's not saturday yet so if you're watching this on friday that's the day that's getting posted hold your legend packs until saturday because saturday is when those get odds boosted okay they're not odds boosted right now okay it, they won't be odds boosted until until saturday when new legends come out okay so we got about uh 10 ish more packs left with the quick selling of everything so 10 more packs left we'd like to see a couple more red zone packs okay that'd be super super nice you know they're all madden pack here a lot of the time you know you're pulling an 86 or an 89 out of these packs but no luck right there okay as if I, hey, I would love it if we could pull like two more red zone packs coming home out of these and uh pulling something that's semi big to make us back the majority of our coins or, or a little bit more profit right i would say that we're probably break even right now i would say you know we pulled a couple of 89s we pulled uh, quite a few like 86s and 87s there's another red zone pack beautiful and uh yeah so you know we're not doing terrible that's for sure uh but i would love to see maybe just like a coin card or another big pull 87 keon coleman and another 85 all right so like there you go this is a this is a very solid pack of course two 85s 
both 10k this goes for about 25k that's 35 40k 45k and uh, that's about that's about a 27k profit pack after tax that's not bad at all we will definitely take it solid re red zone pack right there all right if only you could just pull more and more and more of those right the more of those you pull you're just 100 guaranteed profit but i mean dude honestly midfield packs too are not that bad we pulled our 89 out of a midfield pack you know what i mean so we've 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 still pulled some solid cards out of these packs it's more the fact of we just gotta you know we gotta capitalize on on everything okay now one thing that's gonna fly under your radar when you're opening these packs is it might feel like you're losing until you realize all the 85s that you pull okay the 85s will make you back so many coins it, it's kind of insane okay it really is kind of insane ah nothing good in this pack this is a really bad pack right here this is a minimum red zone pack so an 85 and then two 83s so no pluses that's a minimum red zone pack that is very very sad don't like to see that oh but we pull back to back okay we see we got a little bit heater here last five packs or so we pulled three so that's solid 86 81 85 ah 84 i mean once again that's a profit pack i would like to see a little bit more from that make a little bit more profit from that but it is what it is man you got it you got it you got it you got to deal with what you got here you know what i'm saying all righty a couple more packs and i'll show you guys a visual representation of the sets that i'm doing i'm not going to do all the sets because that oh my goodness another red zone because that's going to take way too much time but i'll show you guys exactly like what sets i'm doing and you know what i mean makes sense 86 283s and an 85 all right glad we got that extra 85 right there that's clutch we will definitely take that all right last pack here come on baby hopefully you guys enjoyed this video hopefully you guys learned so oh my goodness we're ending on a pro ace oh my gosh yo what wait that's actually so big so clutch please give me something massive here something insanely big maybe a coin card okay 86 86 it's a full one could be big probably an 85 it's an 86 386 wow that's crazy that's not very good once again dang it dude all right it is what it is anyways let's go talk about these sets really quickly here show you the visual representation because i got some thursday night football to watch boys we got we got uh, we got we got we got some bets to sweat out you know what i'm saying brother so anyways what do we have here so we have okay i want you guys building we're going to completion percentage here i want you guys building 85s right right with our 83s building 85 team of the weeks okay if you go 85 team of the week right here this is the set the one that takes three build that three or just as many times as you can with your 83s put all your 83s into there after that you're going to come over here to this 88 overall aaron Rodgers, okay and you're just going to build him non-stop as well and as you can see the reason you want to put them into the team of the week is because you need 85s right you need to put all your 85s into here and then you need one 85 overall team of the week player to put into here and then you can go ahead and complete that set so don't worry about anything you know the only reason we're doing that team of the week set is to build these cards now with these 88s that you go ahead and pull you are then going to go ahead and put them into that 90 overall team builder sets all right and they all pretty much go for about 150 plus some go for about 170 and it all depends on just what one goes for the most on the market at that specific time so to do that you guys can go actually to the market search up 90 team builder and that's gonna be this one right here by the way the 90 team builder set as you can see you can put three eights three eighties and one eighty six make sure not to put 89s in there right if you put an 89 in there you're losing out on 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 on, on some coinage so i'm gonna sell my 89s i'm gonna get the coins for that I'm going to build probably two or three of these team builders with all the cards that we got. And then boom, we're actually up because if I spent maybe 300, 400 K training, right? 400 K on training. I've got these two 89s to sell, which is going to get us back about hundred K. So then I need to make 300 K as long, but I'm going to build like two, even two of those 90 team builders to make me break even. And then I'm going to be able to build at least one more. I know that for a fact with all these cards that I pulled and that's going to go ahead and make me an extra, maybe hundred thousand coins profit. So those last couple of red zone packs really clutched up for they were very very profitable guys if you have any questions at all ask them down below i will i will answer them the best i can okay uh, i'm probably at a football game right now so i'm gonna be freezing my butthole off okay boys but nonetheless i will answer them when i get a chance to all right boys hey always twitch you can watch me do it all live ask me questions there i'll see you guys all later long video i know peace